Welcome to a brief tutorial to show you how easy it is to design your own folds flat pen. From the home page, you hover the mouse over the design your own folds flat button. Here you have the option to create your own from scratch or choose from a variety of preset designs and backgrounds. For this video, we will design from scratch, so click on create your own from scratch. This brings you to a view of the design template. Click on the template thumbnail to go to the design your own main page. On the main page, there is a pricing, quantity discounts, and shipping information. You can also enter the number of pens you want to buy. For now, let's start with the quantity of six. Now you're ready to design, so let's click on create now, and the designer will pop up. On the right hand side of the page, Step 1 instructs us to choose background color. Click on select color. Quite a few color options appear in the pop-up box. Let's click on an orange shade to choose orange. When we do, the folds flat template has now changed to orange. One thing to note is the two vertical and one horizontal line on the template. This is a no print zone where the folds flat pen is going to fold. No imprint, background color, text, etc. will print on these lines. You need to keep that in mind while decorating. At any point during the design process, you can change your background color by re-clicking on select color and choosing another color. After you choose your color, you can enter or change the quantity of pens you wish to buy. The pricing will change accordingly based on the quantity discount pricing on the previous page. If you want to see all the pricing again, you can click on Product Info, which is found right under the Add to Cart button. You can now begin to add pictures and text to your folds flat. At the upper left, you can add image and add text. Let's add an image first by clicking on Add Image, and then Add Image again. You can now choose an image located on your computer, phone library, or from social media. Let's choose an image that we have in a folder on our desktop. First, select the photo you want to use, and then click Select Image. The copyright permission page pops up. This page is important, as it confirms that you have the right to reproduce the image that you have selected on your Folds Flat Pen. Once you confirm you do, click in the box, and then click OK. The picture now appears on the Folds Flat design page. You can grab it by holding down the left mouse button over the picture. Let's drag it to the top of the circle. You can resize the image by using any of the four squares located in the corner of the picture. When you hover over the square, an arrow appears. Click on the left mouse button or use your finger on your phone to resize the image. Note that the image is set up to resize proportionately. If you don't want to resize it proportionally, turn off this feature, which is found in the Properties area on the Advanced setting on the right-hand side of the page. Back to the image, you can use the box with the dual arrow in it to rotate the image. Once you are done working on this image, click anywhere outside the image area to stop working on it. You will see the squares around the image are gone. If you note the bottom right of the designer page, there is a layer section. This is where all the image and text elements that make up the design are placed. If you want to change, fix, or erase any of the elements, you can click on the proper layer found in this area to make any modifications. If you accidentally move your image off of your screen, go to the layer section and click on that image. Then, in the properties section, click on the center align button to recenter it. You can add another image if you want by clicking on Add Image again and going through the process. But instead, let's add text by clicking on Add Text and then Add Text again. Type in your text and click on the Add Text button. You can now grab, move, and rotate the text just like you did with the image. Under Properties on the right-hand side, you also have the ability to change the font for your text. Change the color of the text 
make it bold, italics, etc. Keep in mind the two vertical and one horizontal lines as a no print zone when placing text. Once you have positioned the text, click outside the area. The text now appears in the bottom right layers area as another element in your design. You can add additional text or image layers as needed for your design. Note that at any time during the design process, you can save your design by clicking on Save Layout at the bottom right of the design page. You are prompted to enter a name for your design. Your layout is now saved and can be accessed by going to the home page and clicking on My Account, and then clicking on Save Layouts on the left side of the page. You can choose to delete or modify your saved layouts. You are now done designing, so click on Add to Cart and either decide to design another Folds Flat Pen or continue to check out. Happy designing!